You're listening to Mittens in the Morning, a Community Cat News production. Find your sunny spot and get cozy, because you do not want to miss my guest this morning. Best-selling feline author Kiki Marchuliano is in the studio. She's got a brand new book out called, Oh, It's You, Love Poems by Cats. You may remember that I am also a published author. My cookbook, From Treetop to Stovetop, came out last year, and I'm excited to sit down with another feline author to talk writing. Kiki, welcome to the show. Thanks for having me, Mittens. Kiki, I was up all night reading your new poetry collection. I've never read a book that so perfectly captured the feline-human relationship. Tell me about the human who inspired these poems. My human's name is Francesco. He's a pretty typical human, needy, forgetful, clumsy, and he's declawed, so he's pretty defenseless on his own. My sister Lilo stayed behind with him in New York because he really can't be left by himself. My street cat friends tell me all the time, I don't know how you do it. Humans are so needy. And it's like, yeah, they are, but have you seen them eat pizza with their hands? It's adorable. That right there is the conflict that inspired me to write these poems. Francesco drives me crazy. What with the door shutting and the bag rustling, and don't even get me started on the time he brought home a blender. Ugh. Ugh, my human had a smoothie phase. Worst two weeks of my life. But then I walk in on him sleeping, and it's just like, uh, how could I not love this helpless goofball? I feel like this is a good time for you to read Always Watching You. I really connected with that one. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, okay, uh, here we go. Always Watching You, dedicated to my human, Francesco. You are my favorite channel. You are my only show. The show I watch so often, I can impersonate you to a T. Doi, 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 I forgot why I came in here. Doi, 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 I forgot what I was doing. Doi, 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 the too hot pizza was too hot. Doi. And I wouldn't change the channel. I wouldn't change you for any other remarkable idiot in the world. This is so real! One time my human walked all over the house looking for glasses that were on her face. How do they even survive? Can you imagine humans living outside? They'd be like, I know I climbed this tree for a reason. Does anyone know why I climbed this tree? They wouldn't last a week. They have no hunting instincts. Does your human do that thing where they, they open the fridge, look at the food... Close the fridge. And then a minute goes by and they open the fridge again, look at the food, close the fridge. I I don't get it. You have such a high-maintenance human. I'm wondering how you found time to write this book. First, I tried mornings. And that was impossible because that's when Francesco drinks his coffee and gets the zoomies. They're addicted to that stuff. My human is trying to quit and it's hilarious. She stumbles around in the morning like she's half asleep. She keeps forgetting that she's already fed me, so so I had, like, three breakfasts this morning. Nice. I finally figured out the only time I could write was when my human was sleeping. That must have really cut into your nighttime shenanigans. (laughs) It was a sacrifice. I mean, I I can't remember the last time I ran laps around the house at 3 a.m. But you know, you're an author yourself. You don't fit writing into your life. You rearrange your schedule so you can give life to this beautiful thing that demands to be born. Well said, Kiki. I'd like you to close us out with a poem, whichever one feels most appropriate. This one is called Believe in Us. To me, you will always be that special person who bought the wrong cat bed four times in a row. Four. And yet, I still try to make us work. Beautiful, Kiki. Tell the listeners at home where they can find your book. You can find Oh, It's You. Love Poems by Cats. Everywhere Cats Buy Books. Also, it's on Amazon. Wait, the box company? They sell books too? 
Yes, you can actually order the book and they'll send it in a fresh cardboard box. Well, what are you waiting for, listeners? Go order your copy. Kiki, thank you for coming on the show today. I'd like to thank Meow Meow Puffy Tail for sponsoring this episode of Mittens in the Morning, a community cat news production. Has your human started juicing, blending, grinding, or otherwise making too much noise in the kitchen preparing food? If your human is disturbing the peace, I will disturb their peace. I'm Meow Meow Puffy Tail, feline rights attorney. I will restore peace and law and order in your kitchen, and I will get you the settlement you deserve. Call today, 555-555. Just lay on the phone. He's your human making pay.